Hello everyone. I am myself Dr. Rajesh Gubba. I am the general medicine educator. So in this short video, I will be discussing about the congenital adrenal hyperplasia. So the very important point you need to understand that congenital adrenal hyperplasia is a clinical scenario where there is deficiency of the enzymes which are required for the glucocorticoid synthesis. And the deficiency of these enzymes are mainly due to gene mutation. So what are the genes which are being mutated? That is CYP21A2, CYP17A1, HSD3B2, CYP11B1. These are the genes mutated. And the very important multiple choice question is, the most common gene which is being mutated, it is CYP21A2, which is responsible for 90 to 95 percentage of cases. And due to mutation of this particular gene, what is the abnormality? So, because of this gene mutation, the enzyme which is being deficient is 21 alpha hydroxylase deficiency, due to which there will be glucocorticoid deficiency, mineralocorticoid deficiency, and adrenal androgen excess. And how will you diagnose this 21 hydroxylase deficiency by measuring the levels of 17 hydroxy progesterone? then 21 deoxycortisol levels have to be tested within the serum and as well as in the urine. So what is the drug of choice? Because there is glucocorticoid deficiency, drug of choice will be hydrocortisone. And for achieving the fertility, dexamethasone has to be given. So this is a short video on the topic of congenital adrenal hyperplasia. And the very important point you need to remember is the most common gene which is being mutated is CYP21A2 due to which there is 21 hydroxylase deficiency. Thank you very much.